And if you guys did, I really, I really love you guys. But if you guys didn't, I still love you guys. And yeah, I'm like one of weird streamer. I'm gonna tell you guys stories while I'm gaming. Okay. Sometimes it can be personal stories. Sometimes it can be just stories I want to tell you guys. And yeah. So right now, this one's like a personal story. I don't think people would believe it if I told you guys this. But, um, I'll just say I am officially a black belt. And... Thank you. 
So, me and the boy were playing. I could actually show you guys if where we were fighting at, like tomorrow. So, me and the boy were fighting outside and from church, um, on not in front of the church, but on the side of the church, play fighting. I pushed him a little bit too hard. He started crying. I backed out like, like the little person that would be. And he charged at me, so I took him down and said, You lucky I'm not hurting you right now, but I'm hurting myself. And I said, Boy, I did not mean to hurt you, so can you please calm down? The next time you charge at me, I'm going to be pissed, and I'm going to attack you. So, he, he was whining and stuff. I tried checking up on him, and he tried to charge at me again. This time was a different story. I was like, no, 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 no. That's not how it's going to happen. So I literally took the little boy, and I flipped him on his head. So when I flipped him on his head, he got mad. And he tried, he tried charging at me. So I ran inside my house and locked the door. And my brother was outside laughing his butt off. So I was torturing the little boy by running back and forth saying, Nana, 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 you can't get me. Nana, 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 you can't get me. Until him and his brother decided to go home. So, many months passed by. I didn't see the little boy anymore. I didn't know where he lived at. to join in and I couldn't handle my ground anymore so I basically went into a dog push -up position. Actually I was laying down on the ground crying because my cousin was trying to not even trying to help me or nothing. So I was frustrated and I was mad and I was and I was 
can't trust my cousins anymore. And yeah. So after that, I became a demon. known he was inside the house camping I would have pulled out my assault rifle and shot him in the head like three times and I would have killed him but guys that's the end of the story I hope you guys enjoyed the beat that well basically I'm gonna tell you a little bit more of the story I beat this kid very very bad that he was bleeding and the teacher's like yeah we have to stop this as soon as possible so only teacher, I literally punched a teacher in the face. And it was like, he's never hit us. He's been bad, but he's never hit us. So the teacher literally did her what she knows how to calm me down and do. It literally just gave me a big hug and bent my finger back. And I started crying. And she literally took me down the hall to another classroom. Where I continue to cry and calm down. And the other teacher was trying to figure out what was going on. Why was I doing this? What what happened? And stuff like that. And me not being person to snitch. Tell them what I, why I was doing it. I was like, okay, so this is this this is happening. And this this this. If you guys don't believe me, I can actually show you a picture of... Of my black eye. That I had after the fight. Yeah I had a black eye. After. After the fight I got into. Cause the next couple of days. It was picture day. So. 
I literally had a black eye. So yeah, guys, if you guys don't believe me, I'll show you the picture because I have them right beside me right now. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And yeah. Bye.